Hey folks, this is Tavorn, and welcome back to my playthrough of Surge 2. Somebody just cocked a gun. Who fucking cocked a gun? Um, anyway, uh, here we are back where I died. Um, I have now picked up the quest for the Force Hook. And now I'm going to deal with these little shits. Because, fuck them. Where it, oh, it's over there. That's not what I wanted to do, but it'll work. Fuck out of here. Use up most of my fucking Omni cells on you. I don't give a shit. Oh! Oh, you little mother! Come on. Come on, do it again. Don't, come on. Asshole robots. Who's shooting at me now? All right, this is where I came out. Oh. This is where I came out last time and dealt with those two. Hey buddy, you okay? You good? You thinking about some stuff? Tell you what, it's hard to think about some stuff without a fucking head. Oh! Mm. When I get up there, I am going to royally fuck you. Come here. Come here, do your thing. Nope, let's do it again. Oh, nope, come on. Okay, folks, I need to take a breath. I am getting really irritated with these robots. Um, mm, I'll say this for this game. Um, there's very much when you're playing badly, it punishes the hell out of you. I do like the fact that recovering from a few bad plays is so much easier in this game than it is in other Souls-likes. Because you don't have a completely limited number of heals in between. So if you play badly in other Souls-likes, there's nothing you can do. Um, You can't... Oh, fuck. Nanite explosion. Wasn't expecting that. So yeah, when you play badly in other Souls-likes, because of the things like the Estus Flask system in Dark Souls, and a lot of games use a similar system where you only restore your healing... Um, Either there's a limited number of drops you can pick up with the possibility of finding some from enemies or you literally have to go to a place to rest 
to restore your heals. And the Surge, when you're playing badly, yeah, you're going to burn through heals, same as any other uh, Souls-like. But the difference is you can recover and if you can just play good for a little bit longer you can bring your heals back up. Now the first one not so much um, there were some tricks and solutions to that but mostly your heals were limited by or per um, rest at a med bay all right, so now we got the evidence that Dan wanted. Oh, there's a revenge enemy out here. Where am I at? Is my question. Because I'm not really sure. Okay, this is the one that overlooks. All right, I know where I am. But you can rebuild your heals just by playing the game well, which is surprisingly useful. Um, it makes recovering while exploring much easier. Uh, in the first one, you couldn't really like pre-charge the way you do with this one, and your heals weren't based or your base hill wasn't based on batteries, it was just uses. But I will say that, uh, yeah, y'all can already see what's coming, can't you? I will say that, um, there were heals that There were some heal options in the first game that were based on your energy instead. Uh, the problem was energy decayed a lot quicker and there was no way to, to like pre-charge it the way you do in this one. But it existed. So still, in a lot of ways, just being able to get those heals is very nice. Uh, I really do need to go back and finish the first game. So I said in the first episode of this that I was making this video series because a friend of mine picked it up on uh, a Black Friday deal. And hold up, what is this weapon? Staff. I don't recognize this one. Zazen. Eh, it's not bad. Oh, I equipped it by accident. It's not a bad staff. This one is... Better attack speed than this one, and electri Ooh, electricity damage. That's actually not bad at all. I may actually use this. Um... That's new since the last time I played. Uh, so, he, uh, he asked me to make these videos because he used my Lies of P videos to help himself through that one. Um, through the end game. I had beaten it like three times before he had made it halfway, I think. <laughs> but I made that series because I was like, I could do this, and he encouraged me to, and then he picked up Surge 1 and 2 on Black Friday, because he remembered trying it way back in the day, or they remembered trying it way back in the day and didn't like it, so, but I always talk about how great it is, so they picked it up, and after playing a little bit of the second one, they were asking me for advice and telling me I should make a video, so I said, yeah, sure. So I started this series. Um, <clears throat> but 
They got up to Port Nixon and then started trying Surge 1 because... Damn, her tone changed. I feel like I missed the force hook. Um, but they started playing Surge 1, waiting on me to catch up with videos for, for Surge 2, right? Sure, that makes sense. But... They have now decided that Surge 1 is good. And that I need to make videos for both. Because they hate me and my free time. Best I can figure, that's the case. <sighs> I mean, I'm going to go back to the or er, To my first... I'm going to go back to the Surge playthrough... I always meant to anyway, I just, I had a lot come up and, you know, when the time did free up, they wanted me to do Surge 2, so I was like, fine, I'll just, you know, make the Surge 2 videos, and it'll be cool, you know, no big deal. Alright, there's the key card. So, you know, I was like, no big deal, I'll just, you know. Make the Surge 2 videos and then do Surge 1. Now it's like, well, can you do both? Like, no. No, I can't do both. I cannot back and forth between these two games. I know they're similar. But they're not that similar. It will absolutely mess me up. The same way trying to play, like, Neo 1 and Neo 2 at the same time would mess anyone up. Like, come on. <sighs> All right, where am I going? Ooh, ooh, ooh! Gimme, gimme, gimme! You got Cerberus armor. I want it. Oh, you high? You are going to give me that black Cerberus armor. MG Cerberus. Ha <laughs> ha, yes. That is an epic set. I loved it in the first one. It's just such a, such a I'm a fuck you up kind of set. It's so big. It's so chonky. Such high defense. All right. Now, go up here. Hey, you. Come here. Yeah, so here's the thing. I said it's been a while since I played. <clears throat> And it has. It's been a long time since I've made it this far. Because usually I just kind of lose interest. Uh, about the time I have to deal with Delver. Because Delver is a frustrating boss. Um, but. Because of the fact that I normally stop at Delver. I don't actually think I've ever beaten the... I'm beating the final boss twice. I think I did the same ending twice. Um, but, yeah, anyway. Because of that, one, I'm not extremely familiar with this area. And two, they've actually released, like, free DLCs since the last time I've been through this area for things like that Cerberus armor. Um, that is not something that dude did not exist there in the base game like pre everything else that dude did not exist I I know it um, 
so that's why I got excited on seeing him. I don't remember this game having the Cerberus set. I'm sure it did, um, but I definitely don't remember an enemy with it. Where is... this is... yeah, this is the Polaris gear. I've got the arm and the head. So I need... dope. Oh, where did you come from? Yo, dude, I didn't hit you. Chill. I know you... Oh, hey, force hook. There it is. Congratulations on claiming your official AID response force hook. Now, where the hell... Ah, there you are. Take your leg. Seriously, if you're gonna hit me and aggravate me, at least actually hit me. Oh, you were the one. You must have been up on a wall somewhere throwing those grenades at me. That's what it was. Hey, Warhound. I thought I had taken one of their legs before. I must not have. Alright, so that's the force hook I needed for the quest. Chest here. Another piece of the Nano Ward set. Stranger. I had a feeling you'd follow me. I could use a little support. I have to break If you played the first game, this is the Stranger, also known as Warren, also known as Surge One Protagonist. We need to find a guess this time it might take for Alright, he's asking well, about a so key card. Uh uh in we go. And you already have the key card because that's what I picked up earlier. And here we have the office. Now this looks promising. Just a bit depressing. And that's why I hadn't been saying his name the entire game. I've just been calling him a stranger because I didn't want to spoil that the stranger is in fact Warren from game one. Hey, come on. Talk. No, no. Sorry, I need a second to compose myself and take this in. They haven't found a cure for defrag. Apparently, children's brains not being fully developed yet can link with the nano. But it looks like the children did those. Gutenberg. Like Jonah. Yes, Athena Gutenberg is in the files. We have to tell. I'll have to find. Good luck. And he's going to tell you to meet him in his hideout. Uh, in case you don't remember, that was the place under the bridge. Alright, now I got the firebug throttle. Again, don't want it, but got it. Now, I've got to remember. Because I know there is a way back to the... There should be a zip line around here somewhere I can take. Alright, that's an award. And now we can do this. Whee! And then we can do... Alright, now we can run all the way back to the start. 
to that dude who asked for the force hook. Give him the force hook and then run all the way back here to get us another force hook. So yes, that is actually how that quest works out. Oh, nope, that's... Ah, uh, but I don't have the lifter hook. Oh, crap. Why is this locked off? I just missed that. Oh, no, I've messed up. All right, um... Sorry, I couldn't help myself. Such a like heavy beat, like it's just pushes so hard. All right, shouldn't have gone the way I did. Should have gone here. To here. And then, oh yeah, through here. <sighs> yep. Alright. Bug face, come here. Seriously. You know you'll have to go all the way back to get a Well, fine Because we were fools. Didn't realize things were good they promised. Take care. Alright. He gives you the code name Elise. But they have now opened up this door. And that takes you to the underground. Alright, why am I stuck in battle music mode? Alright, so now I gotta go all the way back to get another force hook. Uh, I still can't go up the zip lines, which is a problem. Ow! Oh. There's a shortcut there that I just never unlocked. That'll be the one where I was like, wait, did I miss something? No. Well, yes, I did. It's just kind of dumb. Alright, so, let's go back and get another force hook. See, I know I cleared this place. What the fuck? Alright. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Back in the hospital. Nope, oh, wrong way. Oh no, this was a shortcut. Um. <sighs> That's the way I want to go. There we go. Back there, here. Back up here, and another four hook. Isn't that convenient? Do they just give you another one? Alright, then we're gonna ride down here. You can see there's no one there. I gotta remember exactly how to proceed through here because I know it gets complicated. I 
can't go that way because of the door. That is back to the entrance, and I don't have a lifter hook, so I can't come back. All right, so I need to go this way. No, this is, oh, dang it. This isn't where I wanted to be either. God damn it. Uh, whoops. This game. Said I needed to be careful. I know that that's, there's a lot of stuff there that'll take you all over the damn place. And I still... Mm, every time I go in that room, I don't need to go in that room. to where I was with that force hook. Let's see if I can do this without getting lost again. Um, this way, I know I came this way. This way is the, yeah, this is back to the, never mind, not where I need to be for sure. <clears throat> All right, back up. Let's see, where am I at time-wise? 27, I should be able to get to where I need to be um, before I have to end this. All right, so take this force hook. Do not take that one. And then I can come over here. And I guess it is this one. It's the only way to go. So let's see where this one goes. I don't want to go that way. Ah, uh, yeah, so this way. Boom. We are in AID Central Your Command. <clears throat> and this is where Jackass starts talking. We're getting some hype music because we know we're building some shit. Don't remember that. What was that to? Uh, do I check it out? I don't remember. Oh, I don't remember this. Oh, this is way back, isn't it? Yeah, it is. So what is... Up here. Why would I want to come all this way back after getting... You know what? I don't know. I don't know, but I did it. I shouldn't have done it. You ever had that moment of just... I shouldn't have done that. I should not have done that. Alright. Well, let's sprint back. At least with this open now, I've already killed everything else, so... <sighs> now that I think about it, I do believe I've done that before. I think... Can I go up here and there's a force hook that'll take me... 
Oh, okay. This is actually... Damn. I know where that is. There's just no way to get around it. I don't get that. You'd think that that would be like a shortcut for you, but it's... I don't know of a way to make it work. Alright. Yeah. You know, people talk about Dark Souls exploration. Like, with Lords of the Fallen, when it came out, versus Lies of P. Uh, there was a lot of comparison and a lot of talk about how, yeah, Lies of P has the tighter gameplay, but the exploration is boring because everything's straightforward. I'll tell you right now, oh, I'm an idiot. I've been through here like seven times. How am I still fucking it up? I'll tell you right now, neither of those games and the original Dark Souls, none of them come close to just how convoluted the Surge series are. Both of these games are so back and forth all over the place. Let me run here, let me run there. Get lost. It's insane. Absolutely insane. How confusing it is to make your way through this nonsense. No, this is a scavenger hide. Oh yeah, back up here. And then through. Alright. My god, I'm sure there was a shorter way to do what I just did, but whatever, it's fine. Alright. Come on, stamina. Alright. Alright, so we're going to leave this here. I will pick up next time uh, from this point. Because really it's some story stuff and then straight into a boss. So I'm going to stop here and we will pick up next time because everything's about to change whole game's about to go differently um but until then y'all be good to yourselves you know take it easy and i will catch y'all then